Our lives are the brushes. The nature is the palette, the planet is the canvas, and the world is the unfinished masterpiece. My name is Cristiano de Araújo. I'm a Brazilian artist, and this is my story. My sister, my older sister, she was um, playing with a crayon, and uh, she was like just kind of making some lines in a crayon or something. And I, my sister walked away and left the crayon there. And I came across that and I grabbed the crayon in my hand. And then I started to draw. So this is the magical moment because on that moment when I was drawing the crayon, and I thought that was like the most incredible thing ever. I was like, oh my God, I can actually create something here. I can make something appear. I was fascinated by that. And then I always, I always had the interest also of moving out of Brazil. So by the 1st of February of 1994, I arrived in the, in the airport in here in Toronto. So when I, when I get out of the immigration department and then I, I was able to see the real Canada and I see all the snow, it was like a snowy day, the snow falling. And then I'm like, oh my God, my dream come true, you know, because it was a dream I had, you know, but I was not thinking about the, the other consequence, which is I didn't have any contact. I was just amazed in that moment. I came here from totally scratch, from zero. I had nothing. I had no English, no much of life experience, no money, no winter coat, nothing. I, I was, I knew in my mind that I need to go through this and I would do whatever it takes. So I am, there working construction. I work in construction for many, many years. I work in cleaning. I did all kinds of jobs. And I, for no moment I thought about giving up, but the back of my mind, I, I was, my goal was to work as an artist. One day, I was, um, I was walking Queen Street West, and then I saw a guy painting a mural. I approached this guy, and then uh, I showed him my portfolio quickly, and then I asked him to, for opportunity to work as an artist, and then uh, he gave me opportunity to work as an assistant for him. There is so many works I've done here in Toronto. There was one was um, this project called Church Street Mural Project, and um, one of the murals that I painted called the 519 Mural for the LGBTQ community, and well, actually this mural was published in the TTC Metro Plus, which is quite of a big deal, you know, and everyone for a month had my work on their wallet. So the Block Theo did an article about the, the, the 10 best mural artists in Toronto that sh everyone should know about it. And uh, they actually named me as the number one artist on the Block Theo. And I feel like it's, it's a way that kind of it's, it's thanking me, um, showing that uh, that was worthwhile for pursuing my dream. And now I, I feel very grateful. I feel like uh, Canada uh, accept me now for 100%. Look inside your heart and find that passion that drives you. That's so important because that's your bliss and follow your bliss and the universe will grant you with so much joy. If I can do it, you can do it too.